Hey guys, it's Adogs and welcome to my channel. So today we have another gameplay video with Aurora on the left hand side and a Baron Magnus deck on the right hand side. So uh, the Aurora one just quickly um, went first, so I just ran to the grade one, created the token and passed to the Baron Magnus player. The Baron Magnus player discards a heal trigger, rides the pony, and then swings for eight. They reveal an OT and the opponent takes the damage. The Royal player draws for turn, discards a grade two, for a grade two, retires two tokens to create, uh, take, sorry, retires a token to create two tokens, then uses the uh, grade two on regard to counter plus one to create two more tokens. So they now have a full field. They swing for 10, Opponents deciding whether to guard this one, they take it. They reveal no defensives, they swing for 14, they reveal no defensives again, and then they swing with their vanguard for 15. They reveal a crit, so the Baron Magnus player would be on 4, but they did find a heal, and it passed to the Baron Magnus player. the barrow player is deciding which card to discard for their ride line. Okay, so discard a barrow magnus right into the grade two. They call down a grade two regard and they swing at the regard. Since it hits against a soul charge one, then they swing with their vanguard, reveal nothing, the opponent takes damage and reveals a draw. And then the second damage reveal nothing as well since the OT is active on the Baron Magnus player's side. Alright, so they use T for Malice to uh, gain some resources back. They call the Grey 2, which creates a Mamoke token. They call down. A regard, they sack three regards for the Moke to give it plus 15k. And then they use Rover skill to create three tokens. Oh, two tokens, sorry. Alright, so they swing for 18. The opponent. I think he's discarding whether to take it or not. I think it's just delegating numbers, figuring out how many attacks he'll be doing this turn. So the Barrow player does take it. The Barrow player reveals nothing. The Barrow Magnus player it, reveals no defensive. Uh, endless Pulse. Boosted by the token, we'll swing for 18. The Barrow player guards it. The Moke swings for 20. The Barrow player does guard that one as well. And then the Grey 2 will swing for 30k. And the Barrow player does take that one. So they now pass it to the Barrow player. And they discard Akinley Rudely for the ride line. So the Grazer Run line puts a pony to the soul. Then they draw on and soul charge one. So they call a Swallow for soul charge one. Gets a plus 5k. So they 
they use the first pony to soul charge two. They use the second pony to soul charge two more. And they use one more pony to soul charge another two. And the Sweller will gain six stacks of five since the Barrow Player has soul charged six more. They call the Curtis to soul charge two more. And the Sweller will see that to gain more power as well. And then they call another Curtis to soul charge another two. So the Sweller now has 11 stacks of five. They use Curtis to kind of boss two to get the front row plus five. So they swing for 18. They use Robert's skill to stack two tokens to give it plus 10k power until the end of the battle. So it guards that one. Swing the regard for an extremely big number, so the Royal Player does take that one. Um, Barrow Bangs will now use its skill, it has uh, the adequate amount of soul to gain its full effect, which is draw a card, gain a crit, and have plus 10k, and then suck both itself and the opponent's board, and then it gets to call out two cards to regard circle. This is the grade two. The grade two will draw discard one. It'll get the front row plus 5k, and then it will allow itself to grab a card from the soul to the hand. So they add a critical trigger. So Barry Magnus is swinging for three crit because of the OT that was revealed. So the real draw and get an order since it was a one to pass. Alrighty, so that is the end of the video. If you guys did enjoy the video, please do leave a like down below. And while you're there, why not subscribe and hit that notification button so that when I upload another video, you will be notified. Hey dogs out, see ya.